Welcome to the Prep Athletics Podcast. This is Corey Heights. Some battles. I'm, I'm, I'm not sure if they got us. If they did, maybe, maybe. So you will get better as a player during that year. So it was kind of exciting. Like, oh, yes, yeah, somebody wants me. Let me ask you, let's go back to college recruiting real quick and helping your players. You know, Tanner Johnson, the reason we mentioned Tanner is because we both are connected to him, but, you know, he picked the only school or the first school that reached out and recruited him and offered him. You say you like your kids to have options. When your kids have options, no matter what level it is, what advice do you give them? Do you have kind of like a, a philosophy on picking a school? You know, Corey, it's, it's hard because we don't get to go officially visit the schools with the kids. So you 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 rely on your relationship with the coaches, um, and and one thing that you, you got to do it's like buying a car you got to look at multiple cars. It's the same advice I give to the kids and the families when it comes to college recruitment. But the advice that I give them is where do you feel most comfortable? You know, like where where is it that you felt um, that you belonged? You know, where do you where, where, where what about your teammates? What are they like? You know, because you can go to some schools and the the the, the team, um, you know, you you're being recruited by the Big Twelve, uh, such and such uh, league, Power Five league, and they're in the middle to the bottom of that league. Um, you, when you come back and you tell me, oh, we went to parties and we were doing it, that, that team's not going to win. You know, so uh, uh, what's most important to you? And a lot of guys will say winning, so you got to try and help them find that winning program. And that was Daryl Reynolds when um, he went to Villanova, right? Daryl Reynolds could have went to Utah. He could have went to, uh, well, he went to Nova um, and he could have went to South Carolina. Those are the three schools that he visited. During the course of that time, Villanova won a national championship. He was on that team. Utah made the sweet 16. He would have been on that team. And South Carolina made the final four. So he had three really good choices. Um, and he chose uh, Nova. And he became him, Josh Hart, uh, and I forget the other guy's Chris name. Chris Jenkins. Jenkins. They are the winningest class of all time at Villanova. And I tell Daryl all the time, because we still speak, you're going to be the mayor of Philadelphia someday if you want to. And so, like, that's some of the advice that I give about the um, – about college recruitment.